it's Real Estate Tips Tuesday, and this week's tip, we're gonna talk about curb appeal. In this hot market, it might not seem like something that you want to waste your time or money on because your home will sell quick, but a little bit of curb appeal will help you get top dollar for your home and be one of the ones that sells the fastest in the neighborhood. So here are eight tips on what curb appeal you should focus on. Number one, tidy up the trim. This one's super simple. Just walk around your home and look at the trim of your house. Make sure that you do simple things like touch up the paint or to recock the corners and the edges and any kind of cracks that you see in the trim. Number two, plan a painting day. That's right, paint is the number one go-to for any upgrade. There are very few upgrades out there that can rival the impact of a fresh coat of paint. So make sure that you paint your trim and your house and of course your garage or your shed if you have it. Number three, freshen up your door. An attractive front door can be a serious selling point for buyers. So if you have an older door, maybe replacing it is what you would like to do to give it a nice new look or perhaps just touching up the paint or stain on the door. Also remember to replace old and rusted hardware along with the light fixtures on the porch. Number four, plant low maintenance greenery. So take a look at your front and make sure that you plant stuff that's easy to take care of, such as perennials. When you do this, make sure that you do nice edging and make sure that you trim your hedges. Also, pull all the weeds. This gives it a nice crisp look along with maintaining or manicuring your lawn to a nice properly cut yard. Also, make sure that you water it so that your lawn stays lush and green for the potential buyers. Number five, create a space or stage a space for entertaining. So when you're looking around at the outdoors, make sure that you look for spots that would be great for entertaining or for lounging around, like nice furniture or fire pits or even an outdoor kitchen. Number six is to upgrade your windows. Not only are old windows an eyesore, but it could be a red flag for potential buyers that these windows aren't energy efficient. So you want to look at replacing all your windows from like single pane to double pane, along with trying to make them more uniform. Number seven, match the exterior to the interior. Your home's exterior should give the buyers a taste of what's inside. The universal expectation is that the exterior gives the buyers a introduction to the interior. So if your interior is more modern, then the exterior of your home should have similar modern features to it. You want to try to avoid being the outlier on your block. So check around the homes on your block and see kind of what the flow is because potential buyers love curb appeal that fits into the neighborhoods. And number eight is don't forget about the garages. If you have an old garage, maybe doing an update on the door would be a good idea, especially if you want, if you have a garage door that doesn't have any windows because windows let in natural light and make the spaces look bigger and brighter. And at a minimum, you want to try to declutter your garage or your shed because it will help the buyers to see their stuff in your space. If you have any questions about this topic or any other real estate related topics, don't hesitate to reach out uh, to me on any of my social pages. And if you like this video, please press the like button, subscribe and hit that bell notification button so that you can get these great tips into your email box every week. And until next week, have a wonderful rest of your week.